raffles for 9.99. Wait, sorry, I forgot. It's not been raffled. <laughs> oh, oh, you saved it. You saved it. You saved it. What's up, yo? Woke up at six o'clock this morning and drove the 33 all the way here to our yard, to our base, to our hub and it was dirty, so we just washed it outside now. We're gonna dry it off inside, we're gonna take Buzz out for a spin in a proper RB Skyline. Everybody who says the Skyline's not special is a little bit, but anyway, him, we're gonna convert him today. When he go keeps out, going on about how much of a, a drive this car is, but you need to drive it. I was like, look, I can be a passenger, I don't need to. Yeah, we're gonna go out today, we're gonna go for a rip, listen, keep it locked on, make sure you subscribe, like the video, and let us know if you wanna see more of Buzz absolutely ruining my cars, because you know what he does when he drives them? <laughs> Rocks! Come on, man, are we going? Okay, you so impatient. Watch this, watch this. Yeah, let's go, let's go. Bro, you're taking the piss. Bro. <laughs> Listen. Are you, what, what's, the, what's this? How come yours doesn't have one? Honestly, bro, it's a car's worth a lot of money. Just sit in it, what's wrong with you? Are you fucking dead? Do you know who I am? I'm not the love of your <laughs> bro, life, are you, you being serious? If you shit yourself, the leather's really nice. Why would I shit myself, bro? I've been in a fast car. Bro, just sit in, Honestly, come. listen, are listen. You know I ain't filming with you. Like, how you disrespect me? Just sit in! Day. I'm not doing this. This guy. Oh, man, why are you winding me up for? I'm stressed, man. <laughs> Purposely missed the gear just for our YouTube audience. Oh, definitely didn't. Oh, Listen, <laughs> he messed up big time. He doesn't know how to shift, he's forgotten. This car is no ordinary R33. It's a Rips RB30, long block, running a G35 900 turbo. It's on a Link G4 Plus ECU, but most special, it's a Series 3 GV1 Black Pearl V-Spec. Now, factory Xenon, it comes with a factory 400R kit. You might see the 400 rs going for about a million pounds or so. Buzz was about to buy one. Uh, but he sold for 1.6 million, he, and he stopped bidding at 1.5. And uh, <laughs> yeah. so poor people like me, we've got to make do with a fake 400R. But yeah, it's a factory kit. This car, inside out, we'll show you the cinematics. Morgan's got some awesome shots of the interior and exterior. This car is definitely one of the most special R33 GTRs out there in the UK, at least at the moment. You're going to drive this car today, and we're gonna, what we're going to do is we're going to tell these guys how much you loved it. Bro, it's not gonna happen. Listen, Listen it's, it's old, it's, it's one of those old tech. You keep saying to me, you need to drive it, you need to drive it to understand it. Honestly, I've been a passenger in it a few times, I, you know, we'll see. So, in terms of like now, speed-wise, we can feel how fast it is. Mm. What's the quickest you've got in it? I wouldn't be able to answer that question. Top speed for me on this car, I've had a few short bursts in the car. Yeah. I've driven it quite lively. I've never taken it on a top speed run. Okay. Uh, and I don't intend to. I never ever built it for that. So that doesn't interest me for this particular yeah. car. Um, so we have a few bursts. We have a few pulls uh, in the car. But yeah, generally, I've never ever uh, watched the kind of top speed or, or targeted the speed in this car ever. Should we try it? Uh, no. <laughs> We're in the UK. The okay. weather's a little bit slippery out there. It's a bit breezy. Um, yeah, it's not rig. raining, it's not raining, it's, it's not just raining. a little bit damp. Rox was refusing to bring it out, saying, you know what, it's too damp. I was like, bro, the roads are going to dry out, and they have dried, dried out. They dried out, yeah, this car doesn't come out in the rain. Um, so, I've been caught out in the rain a couple of times. You rush back home, you detail it straight away and put it away. But yeah, it's, yeah, I mean, I'm going to let you drive it now, so... Are you? Yeah, because... Wait, what if I crash? If you crash, you crash, bro, like... <laughs> <laughs> you know, you, you won't. You hey, won't you heard that. Like, so there, there's a disclaimer there. Yeah. Um, it is a really nice car. Like I said, the decision has been made. The car is going to be sold. Uh, when? I don't know. So I'm not. I'm not. You, you know what? This is rubbish. Literally, last week he said to me, you know what, Buzz? I'm not selling it. I'm keeping it. It's too nice. <laughs> it's my head. And he said, he, like he said, the weird thing is with this car, he's got a weird bond that he never had with the R34. Yeah. So he's like, he's not letting go of it. But you said today, so you're selling it. You're broke. We don't know if he's. You're just talking. You 
Austin, I, I, I think that it's what I said to Chris at Auto Talk as well. If this car goes, or the moment it's going to go, I have to be sure in my head that I'm truly done with the half A3 Skyline V-Spec GTR. Why, um, why is that? Why is because that? I will never ever in my life find another car like this. And I'm going to make a very bold claim here. And you know, I think the purists out there might attack me for this. But yeah, let's hear your thoughts. I am going to outright say to you guys that in the market today, there is not another Series 3 R33 GTR to this level. That's a bold claim. That's a bold claim, but I'm confident. Uh, show me a better one. Um, I'm not saying there isn't a better one out there. I'm saying on the market today. Uh, but generally speaking, in the UK, I'm yet to see. There's some insane R33s in the UK. Do not get me wrong. There's some absolute savage ones. Faster than this. More yeah. aggressive than this. More animalistic than this. Bigger builds than this. But I'm talking about the general package. It's such an addictive car to drive, honestly. It really, really is. Is that the gearbox? Yeah, that's, yeah, that's, yeah, that's yeah. a power engineering gearbox. It's a manual gearbox, my brother. <laughs> oh, oh, he saved it. He saved it. He saved it. He saved it. <laughs> Bro, it's, it, this is listen. I've been driving a manual Citroen. Let me know, however, Chris. And the, the, the buying point's really high, whereas this car's off awesome, with some revs. Oh, shit. My, uh, my poor car. 
Factory GV1, black pearl color, only 19 in the world. Factory 400R kit. The 400R kit is obviously that one-piece bumper at the front with the ducts in the center. 400R bonnet, which is a carbon bonnet painted in GV1 to match the car. Could be yours for 9.99. <laughs> Wait, sorry, I forgot it's not been raffled. <laughs> <laughs> Never. T37 raised wheels with StopTech big brake kit. Uh, underneath the hood. Uh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> That's gonna be. Yeah. Pull it back, pull it back, pull it back. It That's it. Right, so underneath oh, here, we've got a Kansai strut race, we've got a Koyo Rad radiator, a Rips RB30 long block with a Rips racing head. We've got a Rips racing manifold, Rips racing single big uh, throttle body. We've got some chrome works all around over here. Solid strut tops, by the way. Never ever welded. This is an original, original car. A Garrett G35 900 turbo. And boom. If you come around this way, we show you the interior of this car. Very, very special. If you know your Skylines, you know the Series 3 comes with a pinky sort of grey interior with red stitching. We had full Nappa leather interior put in this with the red stitching. Genuine Nismo gear knob. Genuine Nismo Bro, handbrake beeping. handle. Genuine Nismo steering wheel. Sorry. Is it beeping? Does that mean the alarm's about to go off? No, it's not. <laughs> alarm's not going off. Uh, and inside, there's no massive holes in the dashboard with big gauges, nothing like that at all. It's very, very classy, the seats, which you'll see some cinematics for in a second, are absolutely pristine. It's been very, very well maintained. You could win this for 5 dollars No, you can't. And Buzz, obviously he was driving the car today and I was obviously a little bit nervous about cars catching fire that Buzz drives them, so we've got to fire them. Okay, oh, right, bro. so. How are you <laughs> Yeah, we've got T37s. That's so messed up. We've got a factory um, 400R rare spoiler. It's the same on normal GTRs. It has a little bit of a fin on the back. It's got the, Kaki Moto twin exit exhaust and check this out over here for all the people that love a bit of genuine authentic Nismo badging the car came it went to the Nismo factory you, know, you clean it pretty well indoors here next time can we do it outdoors yeah cool well that's it bro the sickest Skyline R33 GTR ever don't forget yours for just 99p no it's not really for raffle I need to keep saying that was <laughs> sick, right? We had so much fun outside today, and we <laughs> Buzz, did you... <laughs> did you like the car? <laughs> it's sick. Why are you laughing? <laughs> We're gonna be honest here, right? <laughs> we forgot to film the intro <laughs> before we filmed today, so we just done it in the same spot again. So the intro and the outro are the same location. Honestly, <laughs> we do take this seriously. <laughs> yeah. Okay, baby. No, honestly, look, share the video, like, subscribe, do all that stuff, so that one day we can retire from grafting. And not grafting this and selling, no, no. <laughs> a lot of people, they tell me I shouldn't let Buzz ever drive my cars. So comment down below, let him know he's so lucky. Let him know how lucky Listen, he is. Listen, man can shift you. Yeah. <laughs> let him know how lucky he is to drive an 800 horsepower, 500 foot pounder torque, R33 V-Spec GTR running a Rips RB30. This man, people all their lives don't get to drive a 33 like this. We'll see you next week, yo.